So good evening, I'm Doreen Peterson, President of the American College of Healthcare Sciences and I'm here today with Tracy, Tracy Robbins, who as our outstanding graduate for the DETC Annual Conference uh, here in San Francisco and I, uh, I'm going to be presenting Tracy tomorrow and I'm extremely proud and honoured to have that privilege. So we're going to chat with Tracy about um, uh, how she found her studies and uh, what she's now doing. So Tracy, tell me why you chose ACHS for your accredited holistic health education. Well, when I was looking for a program in aromatherapy, it was in 2008, and at that time, there wasn't a whole lot of them around, and so in my research, um, I came across um, ACHS, and looking through what they offered and talking with the counselors and um, the deans there on site, they just had great things to say, and um, they were an accredited school, which to me means that they provide excellence and um, that's very important to me and I wanted to have that reliability behind me so that's why I chose it. Terrific. Thank you. So can you share with us what, what did you like most about your so Associate of Applied Science and CAM program? I loved the medical, getting into all the AMP classes, getting inside the body and figuring out how it all works in conjunction with one another and mm -hmm. one part has to work in finite detail for another part to work really well and it just it just is really exciting when you get in there and really start understanding how the body works and what an amazing machine it is and if we really take care of it in the proper way it's going to take care of us mm -hmm. so I just love that and all these classes that I took for my degree and program they just kind of stacked on top of one another mm -hmm. and as you do one program on top of another program it just all starts coming together and making sense and by the time you're finished it's like it's all concrete inside you so it's just a great experience so it was building one on the yes. other that's great yes. that's great so uh, online study what did you enjoy most about studying online with ACHS flexibility mm -hmm. yes without being able to do it on my own schedule I probably wouldn't have gotten it mm -hmm. done and so I was allowed to um, still be able to work I was allowed to be a grandma, I was allowed to have you know, my family, um, be able to work in my community, do community service, and um, it, just, it, it just fit into my life very, very simply, and it allowed me just to be able to finish. I think that is what we hear a lot from students, is flexibility is the most, you know, it's really the key mm -hmm. ingredient that makes online so, uh, so valuable. So tell us how you're using your holistic health degree now. I know you're doing exciting things. <laughs> well, uh, my daughter and I have started um, a wellness center, and um, it's in our it's in the basement of our home. But um, we we serve the community that that we live in. Um, she is a massage therapist, and so we offer aromatherapy, massage, yoga, and nutritional counseling, wellness counseling. Um, I have created a skincare line, which has just been fascinating and wonderful. Um, like doing, getting in there and pretending I'm a mad scientist because that's <laughs> so much fun. <laughs> but watching your YouTube videos is what kind of inspired me with all oh, of good. your little concocting. So <laughs> that's been a lot of fun. Good, good, good. Yeah, that's half the fun, isn't it? Yeah. Brewing. Yeah, brewing. brewing. Yeah. <laughs> so, do you have any tips for success you would like to share with current students? It helps if you're a self-motivator. To be mm -hmm. an online student, it really helps to be a self-motivator. If you're not, you really kind of need to schedule that time. Mm -hmm. um, so if you can really just write it all down, what you're going to do, why you're doing this, and what you know, your end goal will be, and really just schedule it out. If you actually sit down and do it on a scheduled basis, it will get done. Mm -hmm. But if you're one of those that kind of just flies by the seat of your pants and maybe just lets it slide a little bit, it's easier to kind of let it go. So did you create a schedule? Oh yes, mm -hmm. yes. I had Great. set times that I sat down every single day. Oh, excellent, mm -hmm. excellent. So what advice do you have for students that are just starting to think about beginning their holistic health study? Um, I would say to probably create a community. Mm -hmm. um, the school offers great ways of doing that. 
and it has their like Facebook page, but it's not mm -hmm. really Facebook. Was it my ACH? My ACHs, mm -hmm. and um, it allows you to be able to talk with other people who have the same kinds of um, interests that you do, mm -hmm. um, and probably just you know being able to talk with the people there at the at the college at the mm -hmm. campus. Mm -hmm. They're they're great. They answer the questions right away. If you, if you don't get an answer right there on the phone, they call you back right away. Emails are wonderful. Mm -hmm. um, if you start a class, those uh, message boards are the, the discussion boards. Mm -hmm. Excellent ways. I got to talk with people. I think there was one in Beirut. And we had no other common interest other than we were studying the same things. Mm -hmm. And it just builds. And you find all these ideas that other people share the same as you do. It works. Terrific. And you are our outstanding graduate for, for this year. Tell Very us a little honored. bit of, well, so are we. Tell us a little bit about how you achieved that. Well, um, I, like I said, I'm extremely honored. Um, I did not realize that I was going to achieve so much by getting my degree through you guys. Um, I, I just, I really don't know how to answer that. I just am just honored beyond words. Well, wow. so are we, and I really look forward to uh, uh, rep, you know, representing you tomorrow, um, introducing you to everybody here, and I just really want to congratulate you again. Thanks for coming. Thank you.